Chickamondo. Perfect. <sighs> um, if it was up to you, Chris, when would you go? Not quite done yet. Pascal's coming over tomorrow with the Africans, hopefully. And uh, after that, I think, um, I don't know. Well, I got to see my friend Lee and his wife. They're supposed to come over. <clears throat> but just want to see everybody and give them a gift, you know, for the music, you know, and what I got. I want to give it to them personally because it gives me joy to go to my past, find the people I care about, and say, hey, this is yours. This is was mine, now it's yours. So. I'm asking you because um, uh, I find it, uh, I don't know, I'll skip the adjective or whatever I think of it, but uh, um, you uh, you said you said rather than uh, bail out, you know, whenever you you feel it's uh, it, you're most uncomfortable, you'll stick around and you'll you live through whatever uh, the because of Jad's belief in religion. Uh, we're, you know, thou shalt not kill. Do you think your dad? Oh, I see, I see, I see. Uh, uh, and in suicide too, right? Uh, do you do you think your dad is right in this regard? Well, that's the belief. And I also believe I don't want to go to hell. I've already been there. It's not nice. Uh, well, as far as I'm concerned... Uh, what's the hardest thing about this right now yes well the pain sucks and the emotional part you know I tend to the touchy topics you know to bring tears out I'll always love you, Chris. I love you too, bro. Well, um, I, I had one question. I, I thought about the, the band in heaven. What would be the name and who would be playing what? I'd like to see if Jesus knows how to play. You know, that's what, that's what I'd like to see. Uh huh. And if what would you play? What would you uh... guitar? Of course. You really? Hey. Oh yeah. Oh okay. Or drums. They're both wooden instruments. <laughs> <laughs> or even bass. On a piano, like piano, you know, middle C, Jesus, middle C, the center of the universe, uh, in the Western world anyways. Mm -hmm. uh, The 
the CBD's working a little bit. Uh-huh. When, when, uh, if your dad is the more, um, more, um, how do you say? Maybe emotional or sensitive. Um, how, you know, of course there'll be, uh, what words would you say? What, what would you say to a dad when, when he thinks of you and he, and he'll miss you? You've always been there for me. Even in the shit times. Thanks. Be tough. I don't want you to cry. I saw you cry once. That was more than enough for me. Any other friend that you want to, like I said, or friend, family, your brothers? How about uh, so you, Corey? Who else is? Uh... Uh, Tracy. Okay. Tracy and I never got along very well. Is that right? Yeah. How come? Just childhood things. Nothing major. But uh, he says I toughened him up, but I'm the one that seems to be crying a lot these days. So, um, And then Jamie, my younger brother. I know he's smart, although he buys shiny things. But that's life. You know? Yeah. He's tough. He's my toughest brother. The youngest, yeah? Oh, yeah. He works in the oil patch. He's tough. Thank you for for doing this. Peace out. We we love you a lot. I I hope you you know. This thing is just you know temporary for all of us. So yeah, and, I know. And in the in the zoom of time, it's insignificant really. Uh, mm-hmm. So uh, I'm glad to have. To have met your spirit, and I'm looking forward to, uh, to bumping into, into each other. And, you know. mm. Sharing future experiences. Yeah, that'd be cool. Thanks, bro. Thank you, Chris. <laughs>